A Fresno football coach shot and killed, police say, by his own father. Tonight, loved ones are grieving as they remember and honor the life of the Fresno coach. Thanks for joining us for Action News Live at 5. Good evening. I'm Warren Armstrong. And I'm Graciela Moreno. I'm developing now. Authorities say they are continuing to investigate what led up to a Fresno father shooting and killing his own son. Tonight, the father is in jail, and friends and family are mourning the victim, Billy Wright Jr. Action News anchor Brittany Jacob is live in the newsroom now with reaction from the community. Brittany? As we head into Father's Day weekend, one father lost a son and two sons will grow up without a father. Tonight, family and friends I spoke with today are completely devastated after the tragic loss of Billy Wright Jr. A Fresno father is in jail after a heated argument turned deadly. 31-year-old William Billy Wright Jr. went to the Northwest Fresno home of his father, 52-year-old William Wright Sr. A family friend says Wright Jr. was visiting his father along with his young son. That's when things took a drastic turn. They had an argument, and the argument was over uh, how they discipline children. And ultimately, we led with um, Mr. Sr. Uh, arming himself and tragically mortally wounding his own son. Authorities say the child wasn't in the home when the deadly shooting happened. Wright Sr. used an unregistered handgun that he had had for 30 years to shoot his son in the chest. Wright Jr.'s brother rushed him to Community Regional Medical Center where he died from his injuries. Devastated, uh, shocking, um, unbelievable. Dr. Samuel Morgan with Reedley College was a colleague and a friend of the victim. Wright Jr. was a member of the Reetley football team in 2009. Most recently, he was the school's defensive backs coach and student athlete program coordinator. Dr. Morgan says he was liked by everyone. He's the type of person you want around. Very positive, a uh, great motivator, and, and number one, a great example. Billy had one of those smiles where no matter what day you were having, when he walked up with his smile, it made you smile. Authorities tell Action News Wright Sr. does not have much of a criminal history. Officials say after the shooting, he was cooperative and remained on scene for questioning. Wright Sr. was later arrested and booked on one count of murder. And while the argument escalated to a tragic ending, Lieutenant Cervantes says it could have been prevented. It's uh, unfortunate that it has to get to this level. Um, my suggestion would be that calmer heads always prevail. When you have a situation that rises to that level where you believe a physical encounter is about to ensue, simply better to just leave that location. Now, Billy Wright Jr. worked as a federal correction officer in Chowchilla and was an assistant football coach at the College of the Sequoias in Visalia. Tonight, the college releasing this statement. The world lost a wonderful person, educator and coach yesterday, and the COS family mourns his passing. We will all miss Billy's abundant energy and dedication to student success. End quote. Reporting in the newsroom, Brittany Jacob, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.